No, oh, not dwarves or elves. Wow. Well, pretty of a dream matchup, isn't it? Apart from being down TV. He might get a bit. He might be rowdy. Thirteen men's. Okay, not that much of a dream matchup. He's got two pommers. So he's pretty rowdy. He's got two piling on. He's got the dirty player. A blodge ogre with break tackle. This team's actually pretty good. To be fair, as laughable as humans are. This team's actually pretty good. Um... I'm tempted just to go for the wizard. I don't want to go that 30k though. Could go with the apple. I got play, I got reserves though, fuck it. Let's go with the babe. Got reserves. Hello, Price. Yeah, it's... Humans aren't bad, are they? Like, Ks are only arm right, so... When you're playing somebody with some... Yeah, I was a bit stingy. Maybe I should have gone with the apple. Greed is good. Greed is <laughs> right. Greed works. Yeah, yeah, they get they get decently rowdy. Yeah, I mean not even high TV, decent TV. They get pretty rowdy, especially against elves and that, because I mean, they tend to take a lot more tackle because they don't get to take claw. And he gets the reception. Shit. So yeah, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Actually, he's got the dirty player. He's got the palm. I mean, let's hope he goes to the Dord school of uh, LOS blocks. That would be that would be great. Warrior on the LOS really fucking sucks, but what else can I do? Not a lot. Yeah. Hope for the door to LOS. Oh no, not pan not not bribes, no try, no bribes. Never bribes. Never ever ever bribes. Yeah, I've done that before, but then it's not a bad shot. But then I missed him in, in one game. If I'd had him on the pitch, I think I would have won. So, but yeah, I mean that's not that's normally what I tend to do. Yeah, sub off, sub off the movement one because then at least you know you've got him for the second half as well. Like if this all goes to ratchet and he beats the fuck out of us, at least I know I'll have the ball carrier for the second half. So. I have done that before. Maybe should have done this half, yeah, maybe. But then he didn't go to the Dodd School of LOS. What's this guy playing at? Why is he blocking with piling on Mighty Blow? What an idiot! Ooh, oh, that's pretty good. Maybe he, sh maybe he shouldn't have got. Maybe he should have gone to the Dodd School of LOS. Look 
Can nearly catch it. <laughs> could tackle him I'll try to pile on him but he's got the dirty player ready to foul so I can't really pile if I get two assists on him then I can't uh, I can't put pressure on the ball but then do I have to put pressure on the ball not really could I try to guard lock him maybe blitz this guy with claw and then whack in some guards Tackle him. Alright, fuck it, let's go. Giving up the fucking claw a bit here, aren't I? Oh, you shit me. Should have hit the defenceless guy and put some pressure on the ball. He meant to go there, just fucking misclicked. No, but the thing was, if by, by going for the ogre, it, that was his strength to crack the line, wasn't it? So now he's going to, you know, he would have either been isolated and not be able to crack the line with him, or he'd have to use his blitz to crack the line. But either way, I think swarming the LOS with guard was better than than not. But hey, I could have just clawed, claw mighty blow this guy. Yeah, just no, it wasn't claw, no, it was tackle to make sure he went down. No, it was, could be costly misposition of the claw, mighty blow. I didn't think it was worth pressuring the ball because he's got he's got short hands and he's got fucking high movement guys. At least his ogre doesn't have guard. Can't believe he gave it break tackle instead of guard. Wow. So he's still got to protect the ball, hasn't he? So. I don't know. Like there was certainly an argument for going for that line and everything. But yeah, he's used his blitz, so at least it dictated where he blitzed. <laughs> but now, now he gets two D down. Yeah, but he, dodge is dodge is really good. Like obviously, dodge with a break tackle is good, but but the thing is, 
Um, Blodge Guard is also amazing, isn't it? Blodge Guard stand. I'd go Blodge Guard stand firm. Would have been the way I would have built him. Not that I'm saying he's wrong for doing it that way, but yeah, that's what I would have done. <laughs> Really fucked up not putting the claw mighty blow there. Because if the claw mighty blow was there, he couldn't have followed up here. Because then he would have got claw mighty. He's still going to get claw bombed anyway. Just try and knock down as many players as possible, I guess, is the play. Is this a two dice now? No. Oh, because he's got guard. All right, to block him first then. Oh, perfect. Get a pow. Ooh, got him. Could block either way if I blitz him. So he could block him, chain him out. And then chain him out. Yeah, okay, let's go for that. Why oh, you cunt? Do the two dice first, shit. Should have maybe done a safe move first here in case there's a double score. Oh god, this is typical, isn't it? This is just a fucking typical game of Blood Bowl right now. And then the random, the random block gets the, uh, gets the removal. Classic. Oh yeah, because he's there as well. Shit. I haven't got the reroll, so I guess don't want to get down by mighty blow. So, this has to be the block. Did I have to do it though? Oh, he's got a sidestep. Probably shouldn't have blocked him. <laughs> I guess it doesn't make any difference, really. Well, no, probably shouldn't have because I could roll the score. Pro tips is two dice this lad, yeah. Nice to fucking palm his palm, wouldn't it? Well, one of his palms. 
Almighty blow. Got the claw mighty blow hit on the ogre anyway. Got lucky to get the power there. Hello, Rootcracker. Look at him trying to make me care about the ball. What a prick. <laughs> Protips roll pals and kazas on your opponent on opposing killers instead of pushes. Like six pushes on his killer. Six pushes on his killer. And then two pushes on so eight eight pushes on killers. You can't you can't pile on here unless he gets a boat down, lucky bastard. Because if he'd taken the pow, he couldn't have followed, could he? Because he, if he'd made the Kaz, he'd be getting Claw Mighty Blood. Wow, but he's just getting Claw Mighty Blood anyway. He just doesn't give a fuck. This lad. Yeah, go all men's don't get pound. That also works. I mean, to be fair, I was pretty lucky getting the blitz that put him under a lot of pressure. I'm not, I'm not slating his player for going. Like he didn't choose to go all men's, but I would like to have fucking fucked him up more than just a stun on the ogre. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Try yeah. <laughs> nah, I just one. He just one D powers. <laughs> oh god. Oh fuck off. Fuck off! <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> okay, good. At least it was only a stun. Wow! <laughs> I would have been sick if he'd made a one dice cast after after eight dice on killers, eight dice on pommers doing nothing. I'd have been pretty sick if he just if he just goes one dice cast. No, that. What else could he do there? You know, I'm, I'm not. Sl I'm not slating his play at all. No, no I, I. I never liked it when. I never liked it when. Uh, when Lupac slated people's play either. I could foul him here. Because after all, but then he's got reserves as well. But still, the, the Palmer is pretty big, isn't he? Um. I'm at least gonna put. A warrior on him, so it's harder for him to get the two dice. He can't reach. Where's the dirty player? There he is. Dirty player wants to get tagged as well. Right, just go with claw, mighty blow hit then. Good shout, Jimmy. I can't afford the farm now, can I? Does it put him there? him here. Yeah, it was it was tempting to get the foul. And if I'd had dirty player, I would have I would have thought about going for the foul before moving all those guys. And then you only get fucked if you get sent off. 
and then it's like risk versus reward, isn't it? But yeah, I I tend to uh, yeah. I mean, I will have base there, didn't I? But I mean, I've got quite a lot of guard, four guarders. He's got five guarders though, but I've got the strength advantage. I think if you've got the strength advantage, and or guard advantage. Basing when you get a blitz obviously does put them under a lot of pressure. That was a bit of a shit basing by that guy, like, but still. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> Maybe he's maybe he goes to the Murloc Joe school of piling on, so he won't pile on because he didn't get the air stun. Yeah, I think I think really it it does put a lot of pressure on the other guy's drive, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, he's making up for all the pals that I don't roll. <laughs> Oh, Shawnee being vicious. <laughs> like, at least you have to move two guys in to get two dice here. So I, I didn't hate that. Maybe I should have uh, put the, the other guard there. So that he would have had to give up a claw block. But then he would have just blitz this guy. Maybe he couldn't have. Maybe this guard should have been here, actually. To be fair. No, I'm not rolling pals now. That made his escape harder for his catcher, so that's good. Because now he's got to go three. Three plus without tackle, hasn't he? Like three plus with tackle, without dodge. <laughs> strong arm first skill. Did he take strong arm first skill? Holy shit. He's gonna make a two plus dodge. Oh shit. Come on, failure dodge. Oh you lucky bastard. Really could have done with him failing that, eh? I'm gonna blitz him. And then block him down. Right, so you just let him get three dice. The tackle. Mighty blow. <sighs> Let's him. If you just go straight forward, it's kind of hard to deal with, isn't it? I could actually just not, not, not follow here. But he can just blitz anyway with the ogre, so fuck it. Good.
Knocked him over. Outrageous. As if he could ever fail that. Yeah. <laughs> Noah's Ark School of Team Building. <laughs> If only it had been Armour 7 catches like they should be according to the rules of Blood Bowl. Oh, did he just have a two dice straight up? Oh, of course he did. <gasps> oh, I'm pretty bad, aren't I? Oh, God, I'm pretty bad. I just <laughs> that was pretty bad. I just gave him two, two free two dices. Oh, that was pretty poor. And I got away with it. Stop running a power every block, you shithead. <laughs> yeah, that was that was really bad, those basings there, weren't they? They were pretty bad. But still he's still the ball's under threat, isn't it? The ball is under threat still, so it wasn't that bad. <laughs> Christopher's going to double rolling. <laughs> nah, he, he does. I don't think Christopher rolls more doubles than anyone else. It's just he plays twice as many games as anyone else. Doesn't he? Yeah, of course, Thomas Griff. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course, the shithead players haven't f don't fail any fucking rolls. They just roll powers all the time, and then and pass dodges, three plus dodges. I've never passed a three plus dodge in my life, <laughs> ever. <laughs> he's gonna make a dodge here, then, isn't he, with this guard guy? I guess, or with the ogre? No, he's already blocked with the ogre. So it's got to be the guard guy is gonna dodge and blitz the tackler or some some bollocks. So like there was a bit of an upside to that half bit half man thing really, wasn't there? There was an upside. Oh yeah, strength five, Brett Blitzer, holy shit. I should play some games with him, shouldn't I, before the team's unusable in open. <laughs> Fun though, isn't it? Fun using chaos. It is fun just wrecking people. Blitzer with ball carrier. Wow, what a man man! What a madman! What if he doubles down here or fails the GFI? Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Double down or fail the GFI, of course. Of course, that wasn't going to be possible. Probably just get an armour break. Smooth armour break off that ball carrier blitz. I did fail the GFI! Oh, good. Fuck you! <laughs> Outrageous! Outrageous! What, I can't believe he got punished. Literally cannot believe that he just got punished there. Pretty good having this movement seven uh, show hands on the pitch now. Just quietly. Right, so I've got a th just three dice. Get the pal. And then see what happens. Right. I guess I've got a cover against failing the pickup. I guess I have to.
because one in nines do happen. Brilliant having his having his killer isolated on a on a mere block. Warrior's pretty good, isn't it? Oh nice. Glorious. The rookie hits are just too powerful, man. Rookie warrior hits. <laughs> Uh, this is two dice into a one dice. I think that's got to be okay. So now I can go for the pickup. Yep, that was a hell of a game, that, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, no, let's have a look. Ten. Yeah, I guess two touchdowns. Gets him. Gets him the guard. Yeah, he hasn't removed anybody. But then he hasn't piled on. No, no he's piled on twice, hasn't he, actually? He's lost one pommer. The other pommer's been taken out of the game. Four plus to two dice the ball. Holy shit. He's used dodge as well. Ah, oh, he's not going to do it. Good, because that was a six. And I don't go to the sage school of trying to level everybody up like that, you know. I do when I use Dark Elves, but Dark Elves are all agility 4, aren't they? This is a bit dodgy. I don't like to go in for passing plays and shit if I don't have to, to be honest. He was decidedly no ballsy there, wasn't he? Can only get a one dice here though, can't he? Oh fuck man. That'd have been great getting just voluntarily clawed in the face. So, we need to get this guard in here. No. We need to block him, and that'll be three, four. I can, I mean, I can easily block him down. I just need to, I need to get rid of him, don't I? These two have to stand up. I have to blitz this sidestepper. I pretty much have to power him as well. Mmm. <laughs> 
And that was annoying. Shit, I really, really like to just want to reroll it now just to fuck him over. Guess I can't though. He can only blitz the killer, so I could bring this guy in. Two dice him. And get two dice on him. Okay. That's why I couldn't use the reroll. Oh, and that. Nine dice, yeah, nine dice, no pals. How to let his pommer back up. Well, that was good. That was a good... Uh, it wasn't a good turn for winning the game, but it was a good turn for reroll conservation, wasn't it? Because <laughs> double sculling against the ogre would have been horrible. Obviously, splatting the catcher would have been amazing, but... It was just not possible, unfortunately. Three dice needing... Three dice needing uh, push piles. And then six dice needing a pile. And obviously we'd have got pile on as well, which would have been pretty good. Claw pond. Can't believe he sidestepped into a, into a fucking claw pond block. Three dice claw pond block. That was a fucking rowdy decision. But he didn't get one dice on the ball easy, can't he? And not hard to get two dice well maybe it's too hard to get two dice but not easy to get one dice on the ball and with 13 players you'll have full men second half oh that's guard oh shit I didn't even realise he had guard oh god you need to score for the one dice then on the ball because then he gets the blitz oh shit ok he won't Oh man, he deserves a skull for all these one dices. Oh, I was just irrelevant. What an irrelevant block. What the fuck? Why not just go for that? He could have pushed the ball carrier into the ogre blitz. Oh, why didn't he hit the? Why didn't he hit the ball carrier? Fucking hell. Probably is. <laughs> right, there's got to be. There's got to be a way out of this mess this turn. Hopefully with pushes.
But I mean, is, if this is guard, he's got no chance of that. He's got no chance of the sidestep. Really doing anything. Tackler's on him already. Was my game just crashed? What the fuck? Yeah, okay, good. We're all right. Right. Put him in here. That kills three birds with one stone. What a great, what a great move that is. So, wow, wow, <sighs> I should have stood him up, move him there. Wow, that was pretty unlucky. I was pretty unlucky. There's not much I could have done there. I just put the wrestle, stood the wrestler up. Could if I hadn't piled on it, it would have been three dice. That's the funniest thing. Just gone now. Perfect for him. Wow, that was disappointing. That was really. And if I hadn't piled on, I would have got three dice. So there you go. You could say that pile on lost me the game. Shit. Losing because of quad skulls feels bad now. Yeah, I would have had three dice on him, wouldn't I, if I hadn't piled on. But I was thinking the push wasn't that bad because I could blitz away to score, but I didn't think of a quad skull. You know, you can't not pile on because a 1 in 12, 9, 6 chance, can you? At the end of the day. And still two dice if he fails this dodge. <laughs> silly, silly idea. It's tab and tackle as well, just to really rub it in. No, we're well, going to draw against him. <laughs> At best, because he's got the movement guy. Well, that is shit. That is a shit quad skulls. Yeah, it was 1-1 one, one at best, wasn't that's the thing can't say. I can't win now. I can, literally can't win. Because I'm not going to try to win. <laughs> so... One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. So... One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, there's a chance, though, isn't there? You're telling me there's a chance. Motherfucker. Now it would be a, a four, 
Four plus five plus dodge? No, four plus... Yeah. Would this be a five plus dodge? All without re-rolls. I'm not even going to try it. I'm just going to hit his ogre. We have put a badly hurt. Hope all of his players die second half. He's not going to foul anyway, is he? Thanks for the whisper there. Very good. <laughs> I mean, I'm okay with this because it is just dice, isn't it? Down TV. Just quietly. I'm the one down TV in this game. And it's only ridiculous dice that have given him a shot of a draw. So I'm okay with that. Jim one turn, no. I mean, there's a chance with movement seven, I guess, so we'll see how he sets up. But the thing with chaos, you're probably better off just taking the claw bomb hit and the claw mighty blow hit, aren't you? Would it have been better? I don't. I don't think it mean that much better. Could claw bomb one? And then still try to go for it. I don't know. It's hard though. It's hard as chaos. It really is hard as chaos. I think it's better just to go for the uh, the LOS blocks. Especially without a reroll. Four, five, six, seven. Oh wow, I've got to hit him with a mighty blow away. Eh? If I go, if I go, I can try for a completion. <laughs> KO stayed out as well after the one in twelve nine six. I think he's is is blodged though, isn't it? So I don't think it's worth trying to hit him. Yeah, claw mighty blow you want piling on, definitely. Right, so he could block here, he could block there, and then he could block there. So this could be a three dice and then get him into a three dice and stuff like that. Could work.
KO could be good. Yeah, should have one turn with a quick snap. No, it was it, it was really hard to be honest. If that KO stays out, it was worth not trying to one turn, wasn't it? One, two, three, four. Could foul, but it's relying on his guys playing out. He's got reserves. If these two comes back, he's still got 11. And if my guy doesn't, I don't. But then on the other hand, if he does come back, it's a three plus. So only one in three, it gets sent off. Could Kaz him. If I do the pass, I'll do the foul. Can't say fairer than that. Should have had Norley back for the pass, shouldn't I? That was a fuck up. Fagor, Fagor, good lad. <laughs> right. Oh, it could have been Steel Fagor. Oh, what an idiot. Right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. With a chance of 11 still. Exactly, lemon is good. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. <sighs> it's only a two assist foul. If it had been a three assist foul, it would be a lot better, wouldn't it? Probably not worth it. There's a one for the KO return, but I bet it's mine. No. Oh man, his guy stayed out. Maybe should have fouled. But can foul this turn anyway. Yeah, Sudan, and that's what the last two games have been like. <laughs> yeah, I would have done it with DP, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fooled him. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to say, isn't it? It's hard to say, conclusively. Obviously, if down another lineman here would have been great. Right, Steel Fagor can go on the bench now. After he's sad that he didn't foul. Wrestle friends, he can protect the ball in case of some kind of stupid. Blitz or whatever.
Claw hits, mighty blow hits, claw mighty blow hits. Blitz him with a shit head, because then I don't care if it's both down. Protect them on the OS. Alright. Maybe next season, Blood Mantis. I'm not bothered about qualifying, but obviously it would be nice to qualify, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we potentially score on turn four, so all I've got to do is just kill a bunch of players without using rerolls, so I can do that. first. Ah, oh, big hand. Big hand would have got the ball there. <laughs> Abject failure. Oh dear. So now we'd score on turn five at the earliest. That's thirteen. That'd be two GFIs to score on turn turn twelve. And three turns to turn him over means he'll probably just score because he's got catches. Extra arms, what did I say? Did I say two heads? <laughs> oh, big hand. Did I say big hand? Oh no, I meant extra. I meant extra arms. I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Big hand used to be a 2 plus. It used to be an unmodified 2 plus. It used to be really good. But now it's now it's just a shit nose of steel, yeah. Yeah. Big hand is really shit now, and rain, rain at the gates as well, doesn't it? <laughs> oh fuck off, Shauna, you dipshit! <laughs> yeah, I meant, I meant extra arms, yeah. <laughs> oh man, pushes him in for the foul. Pushes him out for the one assist foul. What a devastating manoeuvre. Foul the older or...?
Oh, brilliant. Taz yourself, you prick. <laughs> yes. That's a GFI. So GFI, then move him in. Then move him in. Then block him. He can't then sidestep. Oh, he doesn't clear him though, does it? I mean, you could just blitz him. I guess at the end of the day, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be terrible to just blitz him. But I'd obviously, much rather blitz that guy. I don't want to make it through, guys. Foul him this turn anyway. Okay, don't have to foul him then. That was all right, wasn't it? I'll take that. I'll take that, I guess. Guess that's all right. I don't want to give him assists on the foul here, and would like to foul him. But then want to protect the ball a bit as well, don't I? I mean, he's hundred percent going to foul. If I if I just let him foul, he's going to he's going to foul. Big foul. One, two. Three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Double GFI. Ugh, I've got to protect the ball this side. Should be here. Stops the dodge through. Yeah, okay, that's all right. So he can come up here now. Okay, now. That seems okay. Not a bad turn. Killing a KO. Five plus dodge out. Doesn't seem very good though. But then neither does getting fouled next turn. Can't re-roll it. He will foul. And this way he gets to protect the ball as well, if it works. Puts him on the ground at least. Hand off, maybe. Oh, he's just one. He's just one GF. He is just one dodge away. Oh shit! I thought I, I only thought about going this way, which would have been two dodges. I didn't think I'd just go on that way. I should have moved here anyway. There was no need to be there. It should have been here. Yeah, I, I could go for a quicker score. Yeah, I could go for a hand off. To Norley too, which would be perfect. Just quietly. Yeah, I've got to go for the handoff to Norley too next turn. I probably should go for it to be fair. Three plus dodge in with with dodge. 
It's not even bad, is it? Two dice. I just fucking put it in the wrong place there. All right, I think he has to go for it, even though it's, you know, it's the two plus, the two GFIs and the bonehead are unlikely to work. The dodge is is the safest part of it, isn't it? Killed, killed his best player. Oh, he made a dodge. He made a dodge. And then luckily kept the kept the break tackle for this. <gasps> wow, he was so lucky to keep the break tackle. Obviously not lucky to fail it, but still. He was lucky to keep the break tackle, wasn't he? Mighty blow doing things. Um, yes, you can block you. Mm -hmm. I could make it three dice, but should have done. Just go for the GFI next turn, then, eh? Yeah, the ads is unfortunate, Loopy Steubens, but I can't do them manually, so... Hello, Skurumetto. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the win now, yeah, obviously. Gotta play for the win. Like he's still got catches, which are obviously a pain in the ass. But then you've got to, I've got tackle and the wrestle frenzy, so got two ways to get them down. But yeah, with all these cars, five cars, even though he's got three reserves or two reserves. thought he was going to, but luckily he uh, he wrestled me, bastard. I wanted to take the power just so I could hit him with claw. <laughs> claw pump. Alright, so they've got a three dice claw him. I'm going to have to do two GFIs to score. I 
Ich so dämmer. Shit. Safe moves first though, look at this. Fuck off. <sighs> no touch down this turn then, eh? Fuck's sake. He's supposed to get 40. <laughs> yeah, if only. Yeah, maybe I should have fouled. He is mighty blow guard, isn't it? Wouldn't have been bad to foul, maybe. Because I've got the reserve still. But still, it's easier for him to get a cars, isn't it? You never know. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 players. 3. Four, five players on the pitch. Six, seven, eight, eight max. I wish I could have scored last turn. If I'd fouled him, if this is a Kaz, if I'd fouled him, it might have been the other way around, might not it? This could be a two-player swing, this block. Yeah, that fucking catcher. He was the one that I quad schooled against as well, isn't it? Same one. Same fucking catcher. Murdered them, but it might be too little too late. But not now. Now, now I can clear him for sure. And then go in and score. And then three turns to turn them over. And score. <laughs> nice. Nah, two frenzy rackles too much, innit? I, well, I think it's too much anyway. Could uh, could actually claw pom him if I just went for the block with him. But I think it's better to just go for the claw pom hit. Oh, baby. Come on, kill him. Fuck's sake. Like, I guess I've got to go for the win. I guess I just have to. Because he could have seven players. Yeah. <laughs> Reroll it badly there. Glorious. Glorious. Good timing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Backyard Dodo. Thanks for the resub. Thanks for staying fantastic. Wow. <laughs> of 
course he gets all four back. Wow, man. You can just come around and hit him with pom-pom, which I don't like. I don't think I can give up the sidelines like this. Fuck it, let's go. Oh, I like this, maybe. Alright. Then that leaves the middle mega exposed oh, I've got to drive for the win like Eli Manning Yeah, I probably should have just taken the draw. Much more likely to lose than win, I think, against eight players now. Yeah, Clapman, because people generally block in the middle with their with their big guys. <laughs> I think it's my my one, which is the sandwich stand. Yeah, it's my my stadium. Cancelling throw rock. <laughs> like as lucky as I was to make four KOs and five cars, it is pretty unlucky that they all came back. Well, three KOs and four KOs, because you know if he'd had. If they had two less players, this turnover is looking a lot more likely, including both. Well, no, one catcher was KO'd, wouldn't he? If he only had one catcher, it's a lot less to worry about. He didn't take the bait anyway. I'm trying to pom my pom. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it was worth it, yeah. Really is left the left side the home one. I thought I was always on the left. Is that how it works? Yeah, one reroll for each turn there, that was pretty good. That was pretty handy getting the rerolls.
Oh, is he going to blitz a hole with the ogre? Holy shit. God, that quad skulls is, was disappointing, wasn't it? I'm actually quite good for Fiburio. And I was thinking of, um, well, I mean, I haven't done a lot of that in my life, but I was, I was quite proficient when I was younger. And I would actually quite like to get good, properly good at art. So what I was going to do was, I was going to do some drawing and that. And then when I get okay, I thought I could even stream it with a creative thing. So there you go. There you go. Why do I say there you go all the time? It pisses me off. Oh, he's going to carry on the dirty player. Oh, no. Now, Shawnee, now. That's the thing, because Blitz and the Killer, he can't break through, can he? That was, that was the idea, by offering up my two best players as sacrifices. If he Blitzes them, he can't progress. Still got plenty of time, I guess, four turns. Well, if he fails his pickup... Oh, baby! <laughs> Alright, well, that was, that was pretty good, wasn't it? Oh, that's a dodge. Shit. Shit. Wrestle to make sure of the knockdown. I'll just blitz with him. Hmm. That was disappointing. Double GFIs for the pickup. Mm -hmm. Or just one GFI. Double GFI and get it on with strength four, eh? Tackle a back as no wrestle a back as a safety. Tackle on this guy. If I pow him, he gets to come in and base him. He could GFI to base him. Maybe the wrestler should have based him and then kept the tackler back as a safety. Having the ball and strength falls pretty good, isn't it? And then the movement seven sure hands is is relevant too. He's got to roll dice if he's gonna get the ball and then and then do why wow, he wasted a player? What the fuck? <laughs> why did he waste a player? What a worthless what a worthless move. That was nice of him, wasn't it?
thing is, I just don't want to lose, do I? You know, that's the thing, Nisa. Yeah, I could have. I could have put the wrestle forward as well. Like, I, I think it would have been a good idea to put the wrestle forward too. But the wrestle could have gone in front. But he's got the guard there anyway, and he's got the he's got the ogre dodge. So the wrestle, you know, put the, at least this. At least having the wrestler back here means that I can't lose. Pretty much. Like I know that's a bold cotton, bold statement, Cotton, but he can reach either sideline, and he's got wrestling friends. He's like he's a really good, he's a really good sweeper, isn't he? I really don't want to lose this game. Yeah, be a good bonehead, that's true. Probably have to re-roll it as well if he, if he fails. Yeah, that's a true lemon is good, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean, yeah, of course you can lose if you roll cut skulls, whatever. Or fail the double one, the GFI to hit if they sideline it, but you know what I mean, there's like... No, he's not. He's just... He's just gonna roll more dice. He's an absolute madman. Three plus dodge to two dice now? Is that his, is that his plan? I think he should have Olga blitzed. Just quietly. But he just doesn't fail anything. Oh man. Oh well that's actually probably good that he's got it. Not that I can probably just hit him. No, it's probably not good that he's got it. Shit. Just need him to fail a dice roll. He's rolled like a fucking god, hasn't he? To say to say that he's had his team killed twice. He made three out of three KOs. He's made four out of four KOs. He's done a four plus three plus through tackle. <laughs> what the what the fuck? Two players there. And then two more players there. That's asking a lot, isn't it? Alright. Double GFI, blitz him to there and then one dice him. Could double GFI, then it'd be a two dice. And GFI, there's lots of GFIs to be made here, isn't there? I've got to go for all these GFIs anyway, I think. Like, it's only a 4 plus to get him down, isn't it? Whereas with these two GFIs, makes it two dice, and there's another tackle zone there. And they're better to fail than the one dice block. Alright, good.
Wow. <laughs> you know, make make the three GFIs. Chain the killer into two dice on the ball. <laughs> and then push in the double skulls. Fuck's sake. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah, probably Kurgal. And one was a quad skulls, which is even worse, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I don't like colours, it's not you. <laughs> now, the thing is, I really don't care though, it's the qualification though, right? Obviously, the individual games, it's not going to be fun to get dice like this. Seeing, seeing that I've been dice as I've caused five cards sounds stupid, killed his best player. But. <laughs> he did score because of one in twelve nine six chance, and then that was ridiculous to to get the double skull there after the seventy five percent block. But you know, it's yeah, it's not fun to lose, but it's still like I just don't care that much about the qualification thing. That that is really honestly true. Yeah, I tend to get diced by humans. Cause it's, okay. Probably because you only remember the games you lose against humans. And for humans to win against you, they've got to dice you. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what his game plan was. Maybe he just thought he'd KO and Kaz everyone around the balls so that it would be alright. And it's a pretty good strategy. Thanks for playing Blood Bowl for me, Jimmy, so I don't have to. Because I'm not sure I could handle this game. <laughs> Thank you, Thomas Griff. Yeah, there's still a chance of a score. Both sides at the moment. Hopefully this guy gets wrecked. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, Destinov, yeah. There's two Fagors in range. He's in range still. And he's not he's not in the tackle zone of Diamond Tackle anymore. Just quietly. Need we need an Ogre Bonehead here. That would be really that would be really something else. Ogre Bonehead would be outstanding. Look at this fucking shithead catcher that doesn't fail anything. Fuck me, I hate him. Oh my god, that fucking human catcher. Jesus Christ. I don't even get to go for the ball now then. I don't even get to try to win. Fuck's sake. This fucking human catcher. One dice block him? No, not really. Dodge, two dice. Dodge. Not two dice. So just dodge, two dice. <sighs> Ball goes somewhere.
Like, what does this guy even do? Not a lot. It'd be good to block him and then be able to... Like, just to push him. But I can't get the assist, can I? I've got to push... I can't minus two dice block him. So I think three dicing here is all right. So he's out of range. Oh man. Yeah, it has to be the not lose. What a fucking shit cunt way to play, eh? I knew I shouldn't have gone for the win. Wow, got him. Hey. Alright, good. I could foul him, but there's no point. I right, could he could chain me, I guess. Could chain me, could chain him, but no. Go for this block. Means that means that the touchdowny man doesn't get hit by mighty blow. Maybe I should have just dodged with him. I was thinking I could one dice with him, but now he can get surfed. I guess I should have just dodge with him. And you can get hit by mighty blow or surfed. I think I think marking the catcher wouldn't have achieved anything. The way the way he's rolled, <laughs> the way his dice have been going, like the score was such an unlikely prospect, because it had been a dodge into a block. I had to block it this way, like you know from here. So it, both down a pow, the ball would have had to gone here to have been any good, and it's still been a four plus three plus dodge to pick it up. I just think it was too unlikely. Whereas, and then after it had failed. He just have to go here, pass it, catch it in a tackle zone and score. Wouldn't have even been hard. Shit, he's gone for the chain as well. Are you shitting me? Maybe he's watching the stream, eh? <laughs> I don't give him the, the fucking credit of being able to spot this by himself but maybe he did oh well there you go gonna lose anyway great stuff guess I should have fouled him eh guess I should have fucking fouled him oh thank god I just, I can't help being negative. I just thought you'd have made it for sure. The way, the way it, <laughs> it's just the way it happens, isn't it? You know that they're going to fucking do it. You know that you're going to fail and you know that they're going to succeed. It's just the way, just the way Blood Bowl is. But, um, yeah, it's crazy. I oh, got twice, I felt the dice one there. Made twice as many blocks, nearly, ish. And uh, he broke armor thirty two percent of the time. I broke armor fifty one. That's pretty. That's pretty good to be fair. And then the, the injury dice really good. But then he, he made all the things. His dodges weren't even that good. They just felt that good. 
pick up. He did get the one in nine. He wasn't even that good with the GFIs. Wake up after kills. Oh yeah, he did fail two, didn't he? He did. He did fail two. Yeah. So it wasn't. It wasn't seven out of seven. It was seven out of nine. To be fair. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Made it all eleven boneheads. <laughs> And then meanwhile in the block dice, he made a one dice block that he had to re-roll. Another one dice block. And you compare them to double skulls, double skulls, triple not pow, double skulls, put skull push into double skulls. Skull push. <laughs> and was that just greedy then? Oh, this is both teams. Fuck me, I'm dumb. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Ignore that if you're watching on YouTube. Ignore that. It happened. Look at that. 31 skulls. There you go. There you go. Double skull. Double skull. Reroll the push into nothing. Triple nothing. Push into double skull. Where's the where's the quad skulls? He scored because of the quad skulls, didn't he? Where is even the quad skulls? Like, that was 100% a quad skulls, wasn't it? Wasn't it? It was. It was a quad skull. Not only in the first half. In the first half. Because it, it was a turnover, so it wasn't this one that was re-rolled. It's just not in. The quad score just isn't in. They're listed by player name, not order of blocks. Oh, yeah, yeah but there, there would still be one that wasn't re-rolled, re, re though. You know? So, it is just by the players, but there should be a double skull that a skull was picked. And that's not on. That's not on. It's got double skull re-rolled. And double skull re-rolled. And then the double skull accepted, but that was due to Fago, which I remember. I'm certain it was a quad skull. Third page. No, that that, that was due to Fago later on. That was due to Fago later. I'm sure it was one in 1296. I'm going to watch the replay. I'm going to watch the replay of that turn. Because I'm fucking sure that's broken. I'm absolutely fucking sure that was a quad skull. Hello, Bleeding Hippie, by the way, anyway. I'm sure it was a quad skull. I'm going to watch the replay, yeah, for sure. Right, anyway, uh, got the dirty player back. And a, and a draw there wasn't the end of the world. It just felt aggrieved because I should have won, I think. Should have been a win, I think. Uh, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.